Stacy Bob says, let's taste. Tasty, tasty. Howdy, I'm Bob Galligan. I'm the quality sensory coordinator here at Surly Brewing Company. And today we're gonna to be looking at our newest seasonal Havoc machine. Havoc Machine is gonna be our new West Coast IPA. So West Coast IPAs, again, are gonna be more on the aggressive side. Little bit of bitterness, nice and dry, but it is gonna have a lot of floral and fruity type characters too to kind of balance it out. So all in all, you're looking at a very clean, hoppy, devastating West Coast IPA. All right, let's taste it. Now West Coast IPAs are not going to be in the hazy realm. They're gonna be clean uh, and very, very clear. Really good color. Yeah, the smell is very, um, uh, West Coast are going to allow the malt to be very, very simple. So it's a little bit of kind of like white bread, but you do get a lot of that kind of floral and almost like geranium type perfumey type characters. Ooh, mm, yeah. It's really bright, has a little bit of um, uh, lemon, a little bit of uh, almost like pineapple, but also the classic kind of American hop, kind of cascade, Chinook a little bit, of uh, fresh cut grass and a little bit of that kind of earthiness. So it's gonna be very old school type hopping on this one when it comes to West Coast IPAs, but the flavor is gonna be a little bit brighter than what you might've been drinking in say 2005. Um, the finish, because there's a little bit of dextrose as well, is going to be really nice and dry. It's just going to kind of uh, leave you wanting more, which is exactly the point of it. Uh, there's a reason why the West Coast kind of kicked off IPAs for us here in America. It's because uh, you can't have enough. So there you have it. Havoc Machine, our newest West Coast IPAs. Head out to your local liquor store. Get it as fresh as you can. And uh, having said that, it's 2021. Still plenty of Havoc, but uh, keep the wheels turning on the machine, friend. Really good. Keeps the wheels turning. That's why we drink Havoc Machine. Some call it social lubricant. I just call it beer.